Hi, this is Mrs. Ariaga, and I'm going to introduce you to our new library catalog system where you can search for items in our collection. So first you're going to hover over academics and you're going to scroll down to library. Last year our library catalog was called L for You. This year, our library catalog is called Fall at Destiny. So if we click on that icon, it will take us to the home page. And Quest is the name of this interface. So when we say go to Destiny Quest, this is the catalog home page. It's very visual. So on the left hand side, you see the top 10 books, which will be based on circulation because we're just starting to circulate books. We don't have 10 of them listed. And in the middle are resource lists. These resource lists have been created by the library team as well as by teachers, and they're made public so that you can access them. Some of them will be specific to assignments. Some of them may be more general. On the right-hand side are new arrivals to our collection. You can search for a book at the top center. Just like Google, you can start to enter a book. I could start. To, I could search for this, a specific title. And like Google, it tries to think of what you're trying to type. So it will give you options or samples. And if I hit return, it will pull up that title. I When I hit return, it does a keyword search. So these books are um, similar because they are by the same author. So this is the book that I searched for and if I just hover over it I can get the summary um, as well as more information about the book if I click on more. And underneath the cover image is the shelf browse thing, link. This allows you to view other books around this particular book or a book you're looking for on the shelf. And if I close out of this I'd also like to show you the advanced search option, which is up here in the top center. If I click on that, I could narrow my search in these ways. So I could search by author if I know the author, or I could search for subject. One subject to remember is ebook. So if you're interested in checking out an e-reader and you want to know, well, what are the ebooks that are available to me? You could do a subject search for ebook, and when you hit return, all of the ebooks that we have purchased and are available on our Nooks are listed here. You're seeing 132. Let's say I want to read one of these, um, but I just want to add it to my list. Well, currently, this list is not affiliated with my login, so I'd want to log in. So I'm going to log in as library to give you an example, or to show you an example. And when I log in, I see that my list changes to my personal list. So if I do that same search, so I go back to advanced search and I want to search for ebook, and I want to drag, I want to read this book later, I could drag this into my personal list. And when I click on my personal list, I can see it there. I could remove all if I wanted um, as I saw fit. I could also look at my checkouts, my holds, and to hold an item, I could, let's search for that same book that I did in the beginning. Let's say I wanted to hold this book. I could hold it, which places a reserve on the book, and the library team will hold this book for you by the date listed. We think that you will really enjoy using this software. Let us know if you have any questions. We look forward to working with you this year.